for you. And, uh, come on. Okay, we're in game one of Captain Awesome versus Vicario Money. I don't know about this matchup, man. It, it just is a matter of how long can Lucario hold out until he can cancel that stock. Yeah, once again, coming back to uh, to Lucario and his rage mechanic, but it really is kind of true. Basically, you have to always be thinking about it against Lucario. Like, the question is, does he want to keep his... But does he want to keep taking damage or selectively take damage and build up that rage? Or does he want to cancel that stock as much as possible? as it is right now. I'm not even sure if we're streaming, but it looks like it. Whatever, we proceed as normal. Oh, that uh, was just in time for Captain Austin to finish off that stock. Yeah, I, I think this matchup is at least 2575 in favor of Villager because his camping is just so good. Yeah, Curry is having an extremely hard time getting into damage level and finish off the stop. Although it's just as I said that he gets a really nice string on. But now it's back to uh back to the control. Ooh, going for that really slide down beat counter. I think that's double team. Yeah. Are they double team? Good, good avoiding that, that growing tree there. Yeah, that might have killed. That tree is ridiculous. I, yeah. That tree has so much damage and knockback to it. Job of it, staying completely safe. Size and easy. Oh man! Uh, see, yeah, that, that that growing him out. tree is just so powerful. If you don't watch it, you can get hit with it. Time it just right, you can double that as a smash attack. Best of five once again. Yeah. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Man, this wall is just like impossible. Painful to watch, even. Yes. It, it, it's frustrating to see uh, a villager fight someone who's very hands-on, like Lucario. I mean, he has his tools, but he only has one for the majority of his percent. Unless, until he gets to about 80, where his side beat can actually zone people out, and or and or reach people like villager. Lucario is very good at, uh, at zoning out and just outranging a lot of characters in the game. Villager is not one of these characters. Villager yeah, is the Villager pressure. just has way more tools than than Lucario does in, uh, in just spacing out and walling out an opponent. Lucario being a very mixed fighter can fight at a range of distances. 
has his uh I guess that's Aura Sphere. It has Aura Sphere to attack somebody at a distance, but if he just doesn't, never gets the chance to charge it, that is not giving to him. And also colliding and, and with Lloyd Rocket is doing it. Yeah. Game, so. Lloyd Rocket is such so good, considering it just cancels out any sort of projectile that anyone can throw at a, a Lloyd Rocket. Very good new player. Being a falling hitbox. Yeah. Ooh. And if he can manage to uh, get a, a command grab off, this will be very hard. He, he can possibly close out this stock, Villager being so light, and having that rage mechanic and the aura. 23 is a little low for, I think, a stock. It'll do a ton of damage and get him. Stage control is desperate. Uh, I, I've seen him cancel out a stock at 35 on Fox. So, oh, I may or may not be from across stage. Lucario can do it. Watch out for this. I think they're past you, they're gone, but let's stick around. That's on point. Probably money going all the way around, but that canceling his momentum. Yeah, that uh, that recovery has to be up either. Very significant the longer or the higher percentage he is. It's kind of a trade-off for it. The higher percentage. Uh, the I, I, I just see money just not getting in here, and I think that's the problem. That's that's the true problem. He's not getting in enough. Yeah, kind of hard to get in on Mario on people like this. Usually he likes to just. He's fine with like standing back and charging the ball, but it kind of can't get through the villagers' wall of pain. Yeah. And he kind of doesn't have the tools to, to get in as easily as other characters do, so it's, it's really not the most struggle. Yeah, great job. Lucario Money really good at getting back on stage, it's just that. The lag on the uh, the landing lag is just killing him. It's not getting him enough time to uh, just stay on stage. Villager is just hitting him right back off stage. Yeah, See? Just yeah. A moving hitbox basically it's all over the stage. He can most likely get this off. He can get off the stock if he can manage to get a command grab. That's not definitely not for one for him to get into grab this. Oh, there we go again. Routing. That that fade back water is. It will, it will get you if you don't watch out for it. Yeah, pushing him into the tree with that water. Survival. All right, so we're going into uh, Lucario game Money game. being a decently good player. Just the matchup against Villager just works so heavily against him. It's just not in his favor. Yeah, we, we saw how he, how well he can do against John Numbers. It's just that John Numbers was using Weefin, a character who has similar playstyles to, besides offstage, has similar playstyles to Lucario. Lucario just being the more aggressive of the two. But against a villager and a well-known villager too, Captain Awesome, he just can't get in as well as he would with. Um, it. Doing well so far this time. Ooh, that up tilt? No, that was. Grab 
combo would definitely not win. See, those are the combos that Lucario should be pulling off. Up throw to up air. Yeah, but Captain Austin doing such a good job of staying away from Lucario Money's damages. Those combos are very fierce. So are the slingshots. Hard to shot is so good. It covers so much ground and it's so quick. So quick, it's hard to see. Cleansing with the background is the yeah. kind of one. Ooh, very snazzy recovery there. I don't know if he exactly meant to do that, but that's sick, man. Almost takes that stock. Wow, that side beat hitting from basically an entirely different stage. Yeah, the uh, ending part of that side beat is really good. Oh, working his way around with... Uh, bit of a read, but Kevin Austin is very patient. He's sticking out that, that bowling ball, taking that stock. Yeah, it's patience that's killing uh, Lucario right now. It's not that Lucario doesn't have enough patience. It's that the Captain Austin just has too much patience, if that makes sense. Yeah, he's, he's very good at just... Not he's he's very good at just saying, you're going to come here, you're going to approach me, and I'm just going to wall you out. Yeah, a lot of people who play campy characters eventually, they kind of get it in the like after a long time of just sitting there camping, throwing projectiles, they kind of fall victim to like, I gotta go in on them finally, like now's the time to go in. But, like, no, really Captain Austin's doing a great job knowing that Lucario only has two moves that could possibly cancel out his projectiles. To say, Using oh, yeah. these Lloyd Rockets as best as he can to maximum efficiency. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to keep throwing slingshots at you. Yeah, he's gonna keep throwing slingshots, throwing these Lloyd Rockets out. Using his great aerials, his lingering hitboxes to just. Yeah, I'm gonna just wall you out. You're just gonna have to take it. Void rockets basically every single second of this round. So keeping out that uh, hitbox is independent of his character. Very useful. Also, yes, really so over shield. The thing is against uh, uh, villager, he had the Lloyd, he has Lloyd rockets that just block out all sort of. Ooh, oh, back guys, air. He took off the stock with that back air, but. Can he do it again is the question. Well, if there's anybody in the game that works with a, a percent deficit, it is Lucario. So. It is Lucario, but he, he's been taking his time taking out these stocks, and it's not working. He's trying to... Yeah, that, that's it. That's it. Ah, he reads that. Just covering all options except dodge roll there, basically. Yeah. I, I think this match came.